Oh, I've always wanted a boat. Um, I, I have uh, been around sailing for years, but I didn't actually learn to sail the boat till I was 70 years old, and uh, actually waited till I had my boat delivered before I took sailing lessons here in Annapolis. There's nothing better than getting on a sailboat, even if it's not moving, just to get around water. Hey, I live in Nashville, Tennessee. We don't have an ocean close, so uh, when I get to the boat, it's exciting to me, you know. I particularly like the fact that Atlantic Cruising Yacht had, had arranged for charter opportunities in many different locations, and um, so that was a big motivating factor, and the fact that they're the biggest uh, dealer for Fontaine Pajot was a huge reason why I felt that that was a good group to uh, to purchase my yacht from. I have a, a three cabin uh, FP 47 and um, if I'm going the more time I spend on it the, the more space I'd like. I've had times where I wish I could have more people on board. Um, certainly the more cabins you have it makes it a more charterable boat. I mean the sweet spot in my view is not my boat because my boat is really built for an owner, uh, more, more for an owner, although I've chartered it quite a bit. In fact they've, ch they've chartered it like crazy all summer even though it's a three cabin boat. Um, but I just wanted a bigger boat, slightly bigger boat and, um, and so it, and a lot of the way that 51 lays out is similar to the boat I already have. I mean, it's got some nice new features to it, but it's not dramatically different. And it's only, you know, a couple feet wider and a few feet longer. And, <laughs> and it's five cabins instead of uh, three. And of course, that particular new 51 has several different cabin options. So in my case, I elected to have a Maestro owner cabin on one side and then and then five other cabins, but you can have as many as six uh, in identical cabins on that boat if you want. Ken Crasco is, uh, of course, the person who heads that up for uh, for Atlantic Cruising Yachts, and Ken was great and, you know, uh, very patient with, with all of that. And, of course, your salesperson is there as well. And, and um, Chris Vereen, I mean, anybody that you deal with uh, can, can give you an answer, and you don't have to wait for one long. They're very responsive uh, to any question you have. I always wanted to own my own boat, and I got to an age where I said, you know, it's now or never. I better either do it or not do it. And that really was the motivation. And uh, I remember I came to the boat show, I think in 2017, and saw the first Sayona 47. It was hull number four on the same dock and loved it. And uh, so I ordered it, and then I had it sailed across instead of freighted across. Quite frankly, I prefer that because now I know my boat's checked out. You know, if something's gonna, fail, it's going to fail during that first sale, and I didn't want it failing on me. Uh, I know that, that some people freighter them over, and there's advantages to that, but that was not my preference. So, I'm Chris Cargan. I purchased a Fontaine Pajot Sayona 47 from Atlantic Cruising Yachts, and I love the boat. I've had it for three years, and I have put a deposit up for a new Fontaine Pajot 51 catamaran.